hey guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is concordia and this is my channel so if this is your first time here welcome so today's tutorial i am going to share with you guys my perfect natural glam makeup look i am using a um, few products that is very essential for every makeup lover so if you're interested then keep on watching so the first essential makeup item on my list is a primer and we're going to use this as the base for our makeup this is going to make your makeup last longer so next is a color corrector but this is kind of optional because not everyone needs to color correct dark circles around their face and um under eyes but i do need it because i have some dark spots on my face and that is what i am doing now um guys i just want to say if this is your friend here and you are not a subscriber please subscribe to my channel it's free support your girl give this video a thumbs up share it with your girlfriend share it with your friends it's really going to help my channel to grow so thank you as you can see i'm really excited about this look so going into my foundation which is the second important essential thing for any makeup lover is a foundation some people do skip this if you have like a flawless skin but as you can see my skin is uneven i have some dark spots i have some pigmentation and stuff so i'm using a foundation to like create a smooth base and now the third thing is a setting spray you can use this before or uh, during your makeup or even after your makeup to set your makeup and make everything seamless and last longer so foundation creates like a an even base for your makeup for everything that you're going to apply later on if you have like a perfect skin that's clean that's smooth and doesn't have any pigmentation or dark circles and stuff you can definitely skip the foundation so now the fourth thing is a concealer and the one i am using is by ellie girl concealer this is in the shade fun yeah it's in the shade fun and i'm going to use this to highlight my face so i'm applying this under my eyes on my nose on my cupids Boom yeah and my chin and my forehead and after that i am going to wait just a little bit for the concealer to get tacky you need it to get tacky so you can get full coverage from the concealer but i think you can skip that step if your concealer is like a full coverage concealer and it gets dried quickly but mine doesn't so i'm going to wait a little bit like one minute for it to get tacky and then blend as you can see guys i'm just using this hand fan to let that process come quicker and now i'm going to blend using the tip of my beauty sponge and what i'm doing is i'm start i started blending from um like knots from the inside from the outward side of the concealer
the next essential makeup item for me is a face powder this one is by mary Kay. it's a sheer mineral powder and it's very good i'm using this to set my concealer first before going into a setting powder which is the next essential makeup item you need for like a perfect natural glam makeup look so guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if it was helpful if you learned something from it um leave your comments and suggestions down in the description sorry in the comment section and the next seventh um, essential item you need is a contour and highlight palette you need this to add definition to your face you need this to bring out bring back the natural shadows on your face and to contour your nose and to highlight your cheekbones highlight your nose highlight your brow bone and this is an essential makeup item Sometimes I do use this for eyeshadow looks also, so it's very important to have this in your makeup bag. And now I'm getting ready to draw my brows and the next essential makeup item that you need is a brow pencil brow gel anything you can use to fill in your brows to draw your brows so for today's look I am going in I am going for a natural kind of looking brows something that's not too harsh or too dark that looks natural i do have a brow tutorial um i will leave the link to the tutorial in my description box so if you're interested you can go and watch it and see how i do my brows in detail After setting my concealer, this is uh, an eyeshadow palette, which is something that every makeup lover should have in their makeup bag. And this one is by Morphe. I think it is the Morphe T50 palette. You can definitely go for any eyeshadow palette that you want. Maybe the one by Urban Decay or any kind of like neutral eyeshadow palette that you can create very similar some classic eye looks with and i'm just taking that burnt orange shade and i just applied that as a transition shade and i i used a warm brown shade at the outer corners and now i'm just going in with this shimmer shade eyeshadow to apply this on my eyelid and then going in with that Mary Kay powder again I'm going to use this to set the remaining part of my face okay because you want to do this so that your makeup doesn't crease and you don't have all the stuff that you don't need and then setting my makeup with my finishing setting spray and this spray is very good it's a Nigerian brand you can definitely use any certain spray of your choice that's available to you and now to highlight my face i'm going in with that highlight highlight and that's a makeup revolution contour palette and then to highlight my brow bone also 
and then the next essential makeup item you need is a mascara this is the tanked item tanked and this is the next item on my makeup essentials and i use this to um for my eyelashes for my lashes yeah and then i'm also going to line my lips today i didn't go for any lashes because i wanted this look to be very natural and now the next item you need is a lipstick liquid lipstick and a gloss to complete the look and this is definitely optional it's a blush this is by makeup gallery it's a very not um beautiful blusher this is optional you can skip this if you want i'm just doing this it's an extra bonus kind of tip <laughs> And then just to brush the whole face together and make everything seamless and look beautiful. And this is the finished look. No, nope, it's not. And the last thing is to set my makeup with this Makeup Revolution setting spray and use my hand fan to just blow your kisses. Yeah. And now, finally, this is the finished look i hope this tutorial was helpful i hope it was entertaining i think and if you did like it give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel 